Well, there are several areas in Chatham County where you have no access to public transportation, and that's why a group of students, mostly from Johnson High School, voiced their concerns at a forum with the Deep Center and the Chatham Area Transit. It was the first of its kind. Our Alyssa Jackson has the answers to their questions about tra from transit leaders tonight. For a little over an hour, the Deep Center and Chatham Area Transit had an open community forum about how to improve public transportation in the county. The questions were all from students, ranging from accessibility, expanding routes, CAP partnerships with the school district, and safety. But if you look around, there was only one student physically present with some on Zoom. That's because many of them didn't have transportation to get to the meeting. I don't, I don't know that they could have illustrated their point more effectively than by not being able to get to the very meeting where they're going to talk about those things. Teachers and school district staff represented their students, sharing the challenges they have in getting to and from school each day. Is there any consideration being given specifically to placing um, more bus stops at uh, close proximity to the school to where the students may not have to cross a major thoroughfare. My current high school juniors, right, they need, they would prefer, I think, to take action now to see action now. CAT has taken some action in the past year, most recently expanding in Cloverdale and Carver Village. For that, they added several stops in Garden City. The progress that we've made in the last couple of months in expanding our service coverage is more than we've had in the past 30 years of CAT. Chatham Area Transit is also in talks with Port Wentworth. They are hoping to have service in place by fall at the latest. CAT's CEO says hearing these concerns and direct questions from young people was powerful. The notion that they're that interested, um, that is something, um, that's how we change um, communities, that's how we build better communities. Board members agreed they have a responsibility to address these issues. Folks don't ride the bus because they want to. Most of the folks have to ride the bus. And we owe it to them to give them the best service possible. In Savannah, Alyssa Jackson, WTOC News. Chatham Area Transit is working on two big items right now, including their master plan and a micro transit program. More information on that and how to stay up to date with their progress on our website, WTOC.com. When new at 11.